Hi everyone, here's a problem from our grade 5 math textbook that the students were wanting to see explained in class and so here we are, we're going to do it. Rosa read 10 pages of a book on Monday. She read one third of the remainder on Tuesday and she still had 24 pages to read. How many pages were in the book? Okay, so first of all, I'm going to draw a nice big long bar to represent the whole book. The first thing I'm told is that she read 10 pages on Monday. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to chop this bar here and I'm going to label that 10 for Monday. Okay? Now, with these questions, we really need to pay attention to this phrase of the remainder. Okay? So if she read 10 on Monday, that means all of this is the remainder. And we're told that she read one third of that remainder. Okay, so she read a third of this, which means I'm going to chop this part into thirds. And I'll label one of those for Tuesday. So far, so good? Yeah? Yeah. 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 <laughs> now, last thing I'm told is she has 24 pages left to read. So that means that's this whole area, and I can label it 24. Now I can finally do some math and figure out one block, because this 24, you see, is pointing to two even-sized blocks. So I can do 24 divided by 2 to get 12. So that doesn't show up very well. 12. 12, which means this one is 12. Ha-ha! Now, can I solve for the whole book? Yeah. Yeah, because I have this 10 and these three 12s all add up to 46. So I know that she, the book, sorry, has 46 pages. Make sense? Yeah, round of applause. Thank you, everybody. Thank you.